I'm here to just say some things that he said in the video. In general, the entire video was good. I don't really have much information about all this before, but I will say something about the whole Twice Friends cover up and in all of this, like, there's just some things I gotta say about this. But no, there's no ill will about this guy. This guy, in general, like I said, this video was a good video. Well, the only thing he could do right away was to call his goons to arm. Twilight never started to say, like, guys, go and defend me about this. That's incorrect. Twilight never asked us to defend him. What we did is be friends and start defending him because we knew that something like this cannot be taken as complete proof. To attempt to slander Wemo and discredit him, they made- Our goal was really never to slander him or do anything like that, but okay. Weak arguments like, Well, he monetizes videos, he only cares about money. I never said that and I honestly have not heard anyone say that. Either you're misinterpreting what I said about the whole, like, comparison video but that's not what i said and i've never heard anyone say that just because you monetize videos doesn't mean you're just in it for the money or alt account has a back ban from a year ago without doing any more digging another we did as much digging as we possibly could. I tried to ask Wamo about the vac ban at first, but he gave us no response, so there's only so much we can do in that case. But of course, when you're under pressure and you're trying to scrounge up an attack with nothing to go on... We have stuff to go on. You kind of have a hard time doing so. We had no hard time doing this. Look, this is one of my favorite arguments. And this is one of my favorite parts of the video. You were supporting someone like me if you hate me for whatever reason, just because I cheat in a game or something like that. Yes, just because I cheat. If you seriously, like, despise me as a human being and you think I should die or I deserve death or, like, anything actually bad because I cheat in a fucking game, you're in the wrong at that point. I'm sorry, but that's just, that's just it. You hate me? You should also be hating Wamo because apparently he's a cheater. I don't know if he's st Cheating is only bad when someone I dislike does it. No. There's not much I can say about that, but no. I, I know cheating is bad. I never said this. Stop trying to twist my fucking words, dog. Still cheating, but wouldn't be surprised if he is. He's, he's probably not making a video because I don't give a shit. I say I don't give a shit about his vac ban and what he really got vac banned in. And I said I didn't give a shit if he's still cheating. That's all I said about not giving a shit. So this whole making a video because I don't give a shit, incorrect. Yeah, I don't give a shit that much, but yeah. Yeah, bro. You see this dude with the vac ban with no context at all and all- We tried to get as much context as we could account that's just as bad as me the person who spends their day ruining your match with not only obvious hacks but if you let me ruin your match then you should not be letting someone ruin your match especially some random black kid on the fucking internet dude like but exploiting your chat with spam exploiting your chat no am in my I don't spam. Mocking you while you do it I'll only mock you guys whenever you guys deserve to be called out for some dumb shit like this you're the exact same thing in the cheating aspect, yes. The kicker is, all of these accusations came with no defense of Twilight. Yeah, because I was talking about Wamo. Where was the defense for the threat to kill themselves to a 14-year-old? Those screenshots aren't real. All the evidence that we have is pointing that it's not real. That doesn't sound like him. Yeah, he doesn't have that grammar issue. I've never seen him use a grammar issue. And it's not just me and him in DMs, it's him in public Discord servers. He never has that uh, grammar issue, so... Hmm. It's like you guys are ignoring that. Hmm. Very interesting. They're fake screenshots. They are. Everything is pointing to that. But during this shit show, the toxic person in question did the obvious thing a toxic person would do. Dox anyone who dare question them. Not a really positive look, is it? Not fan- We do know that that wasn't a positive look, and we know that that wasn't good. Yeah. Not exactly something that gets you on his side. Ignoring some things that I've said and believing screenshots isn't exactly a thing to get everyone on your side either, so... But before that, I mentioned something. The last excuse that, uh, the screenshots were fake. Well, uh, looks like that was put to the test recently. Oh? Okay. With the help of fucking Maximilian, the oh yeah yeah guy, Max, by simply flexing his subscriber count, hooked Twilight. Kinda hooked Wamo too, didn't it? Then claimed that those screenshots between him and the underage victim were actually him messaging himself on his own alt account. Which is wrong. Proving that they were fake. Turned out, oops, the account had him blocked. Why would why would he block himself on his own alt account? After this incident, Twilight began accusing 42, that old acquaintance that started this all, of being the underage victim. Of and everything is pointing exactly to that. Setting him up and lying. This, again, failed. No, it didn't. What, what failed about it? I want you to tell me exactly what failed about it. 
nothing has pointed that it's not this screenshot that's about to come up right here again claiming Look, 42 and Sophie are both typing, I could have Discord open, and I can have Discord in a browser, and I could easily do that. And you know whenever you start typing on Discord after a couple seconds, it still shows that you're a quote-unquote typing even though you stopped, so no. It was a setup from the beginning and that whammo was behind it. I never heard anything about this whole, like, whammo was a part of this entire thing. I never heard about that, but... Apparently that's a thing. I've never believed that and I've never heard anyone in a VC believe that either. Even if this was true, he believed it was a 14 year old girl and had voice chat role plays with this child. Okay, so since he had voice chat role plays, then please go ahead and release the footage of him in a call with Sophie. Unless you're just trying to keep it private for a, a future video, that's completely fine. But uh, right now, there's no sort of voice call thing that's gone on right now, but there could be something in the future, so I'll be looking out for that. And we're here today. In this corner is Whammo, Silent Joe, and myself. And in the other is a band of degenerate cheaters who chose to do terrible things. We aren't choosing to do terrible things. Not all of us are doing terrible things. We're just cheating in a fucking game. They wake up looking to make people's day miserable. No. Spread lies. And no. And cheat in video games with hacks and bots. Not bots with me and not with everyone. Stop generalizing us. After all this, what's the point? Twilight, unless they pull a rabbit out of their ass, is dead to rights. The mountain of evidence held by Whammo and Joe is something that he just can't topple. You heard it here, folks. Discord screenshots are now 100% proof. You heard it from this man himself. If you got Discord screenshots of someone saying the N-word, that means they're racist. GG. You're fucked. That's what I'm getting from this video. Discord screenshots are apparently proof now. Only move now is to spread disinformation and- no. And convince the mass that you can't trust either side of the story. No. Attempting to create a smokescreen and make you forget this. No. Forget that he's potentially a serious pedophile. At least he said potentially. Who do you believe? It's a lot to ask of strangers online, but- You should believe the people that has the correct points in this. I'm not saying we have the correct points just because it's me saying that we have these points, but it's because everything that's pointing to that Twilight is guilty of all this is Discord screenshots so far that we have in the public right now, and everything that we have pointing that he is innocent is quite a lot of things, and very, very weird things. Like, how would three people all have the same exact grammar issue? Look at the track record of both parties. You tell me who's in the wrong. You shouldn't be looking at too much at the track record. Of course, yeah, I know you should be looking at the track record, but you shouldn't use that to define your entire opinion. Instead, what you should be mainly looking at is each side of the videos, both my side and Wamo's side. When it comes to these people who are very ready to ruin your day and ruin your game, we're not trying to do any of that. At least, we're not trying to ruin your day. Maybe some people are trying to ruin your game, but you should not be letting random people on the internet ruin your game or your day or anything at all. What you did was a good job of explaining what ha what's happening, but you clearly have a bias that is too much. It's controlling your opinion. But yeah, there's really nothing else to talk about in that video. A majority of the video was actually good, other than the part that I mentioned that kind of just made the entire video turn to shit.